The COVID-19 pandemic is not yet over, but carinderias or small eateries are already facing the brunt of a yet another challenge. The increase in prices of liquefied petroleum gas or LPG. Rodrigo, a carinderia owner, says most of his patrons have yet to come back since most of them are still working from home. He is now trying to make a profit by offering promos for his goods like the buy one take one ulam. Rodrigo is hoping to maximize his resources amid high prices of goods and now LPG. Hindi nga malaman ko ano dapat gawin. Dapat magtaas na rin ng ulam, konti. Kasi mataas naman ang LPG. Wala naman magagawa. Mataas talaga ang LPG. Kailangan talaga i-budget na lang yung, ano, yung paninda. On Monday, Petron announced an increase in LPG prices by 3.10 per kilogram, while prices of auto LPG are now at 1.73 per kilo. With that, the average price of a 10 kilo LPG tank is now at more than 1,000 pesos. According to the VOE, this is the sixth LPG price increase since June, with a net increase of more than 18 pesos per liter. The agency explains that the increase is due to the dwindling supply of LPG in the Middle East. There are still no plants available to cater to North Asia. Some plants remain on maintenance. This is on top of increasing demand for LPG as the winter approaches. That's why the government is asking the public to conserve their use of LPG. Medyo mabigat-bigat na po ang presyo ng liquefied petroleum gas. Yun nga, katulad ng patlagi nating sinasabi na tinaplano natin ang pagdabiyahin natin para makatipid tayo sa liquid fuels. Ganun din sa liquefied petroleum gas na uh, pagsikapan po natin muna magtipid hanggang patuloy ang pagtaas ng presyo. Meanwhile, all companies also announced adjustments in diesel and gasoline prices. 1 peso and 15 centavos will be added in the prices of gasoline per liter, while diesel will cut prices per liter by 35 centavos and kerosene by 30 centavos per liter. Nagkaroon ng uh, parang saliwa na direksyon ang gasoline kumpara sa diesel at saka sa kerosene. Kasi ang, dis, ang gasoline, uh, tumaas ang konsumo o ang demand. Kasi yung mga liquefied natural gas na power plant or mga industries, dahil tumaas ang presyo ng liquefied natural gas, nag-ship sila sa gasoline fuel. So nagkaroon ng switching. This week's adjustment is the 10th in gasoline prices. Adding this week's adjustments, total price hike in gasoline since the start of the year is now at 21.95 pesos per liter. Diesel has recorded an 18.10 peso per liter increase year to date, while kerosene saw a total of 16.26 pesos per liter increase over the same period. For News 5, Dale Devera, we're One News.